one thing that I find so fascinating is this rapid fire. Now, I have not seen that at a conference. What yeah. is rapid fire? And then whose brainchild truly was that? Yeah, so, you know, a lot of what we've done has kind of been conceived out of, you know, things we saw at other conferences or things we tried and didn't work, so we modified. Um, rapid fire was a result of something that came out of year one. And I don't know about you, but, you know, uh, if you've ever sat through a timeshare pitch, you know, <laughs> You know, you're, you're looking for the exits and you're also figuring out how the hell do I never come back to one of these again? And so what we did is we said, okay, let's try to consolidate it down um, to where, you know, you have, give all the speakers a chance to talk. But we said, what if it was rapid fire? What if they each had just five minutes? And when that five minute mark hits, your mic's cut, the gong strikes, and it's on to the next one. When you're forced to, to do that, you're forced to be very intentional with what you're going to say and limit it to maybe one or two key takeaways that you want people to be left with at the end of your speaking. And what we found was that when we did this, it would inspire conversations throughout the rest of the conference. So, you know, you're talking about digital banking and something really strikes a chord with one of the attendees. They're going to find you at that networking event later that night and say, hey, you know what? Let's expand on that. Yeah, from personal experience, I would say a five minute pitch is leaps and bounds more difficult than the typical 45 minutes to an hour. I mean, oh my gosh, right. you have to be so well rehearsed to make sure uh, that all your key takeaways are getting made because you know Jeff is very clear to all of his vendor partners saying, hey, this is not a look at me, look at me how great I am. This is about being a thought leader and this is about understanding the industry as a whole and more importantly, how you serve it and how you can help it.